and go budgets and today is Sunday fun day so if you know you know <laughs> I already released a video today it was my donut binder and that was supposed to come out yesterday but life and life and and y'all I am doing the most every day and that one just got pushed to the back burner however it's out and it's awesome it has Miss B by request so it's super fun and it's everything donut so you get your sweet sweet savings fix <laughs> Um, so go check that video out as well. I'll have it linked down below. But this one, this is our fun time binder. We do a little adulting, and which sucks, but we have to do it. And then we do our little fun time, which has no adulting. It is all fun and games. <laughs> so let's get right on into this and get the darn thing done. How you doing? How you been? What's the 411? Tell me, I want to know. So I'm super excited that I get all these comments and I am super apologetic that I can't comment to them right now. Like I just said, life is lifing and I am doing the best, but I do read them and it actually brings me great patience and great like calming in my very chaotic world right now. So I am grateful for the comments. Please, please leave them. Even if I don't respond, I'm reading them and I am, I am commenting out loud and I promise I'll go back and comment when I can, but I am reading everything. So let's give this account and see how much we have. We have 50 right there, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So 150 right there. 60, 70, 80, 9, 100, so 200, um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 75, 85, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 300. $300 right here to play with today. Yay. Thank you very much, funding people. <laughs> All right, so let's get right on into this. So this right here is my adulting business binder and non-adulting business binder. It's my game time. I lost the eye here, so I understand it says night, <laughs> whatever, um, binder. So anyway, I'll fix it one day. So this is my inside. If you're new here, welcome. I love, love, love this binder because it makes me smile on every, every side makes me smile. So it's all it takes is one smile to change your day. And today's a great day to have a great day and be the reason someone smile. Of all my affirmations that I live by y'all. So being a functional adult every day seems a bit, a bit excessive, but you got to do it, right? You got to do what you got to do. So let's go in here, and I'm sorry for the post-it notes, but again, I haven't had time to create my dashboards. So this is our new one. We finished our, thankfully, sit on a budget to pay for my garage door. That bill has been paid. Yay! Um, so I have the money in my completed folder, and I need to get it out and put it to my credit card. So I'm super excited that that is going away. So this is being replaced by this fun game. It is a game um, of sorts. But it's going to Miss B's emergency fund. I need to amp that up quick and in a hurry. So I am going to go on and put this towards that. So all of this money that we're going to earn here, we're going to um, put to the emergency fund. And the way that we do this, this is a normal roll and save. You kind of see who wins, who, what pizza wins supreme. Um, pardon the pun, <laughs> but whoever's pizza, like what's your piece of choice and whoever wins is that your, that's your piece of choice. Um, so we'll talk about <laughs> all of my idiosyncrasies about pizza. Don't be shocked. There's plenty of them. Um, but we are going to see who gets all the way from first to sec six, which means we're going to clear this. We're going to do a blackout on this game. Yeah. All right. I've talked enough. So we have our dice tower and we're going to roll the dice and we're just going to save as we roll, but we're going to save everything on here. So, first one's first is number five. Um, so, this is sausage pizza. Blech. Okay. <laughs> You're going to get that a lot from me in this game because, mm hmm you know what I'm about to say. <laughs> I'm not a pizza person when it comes to all these toppings. Simple is better. So, Supreme... Yeah. Okay. So yeah, before I just go through my little thing, what is your, leave a comment down below, please. Cause I want to know what is your pizza of choice? Like what pizza, that's going to be the question of the day. What pizza do you like uh, when you have to order your pizza? So we have one of each already on the board for four, five, and six. This is Hawaiian. Oh my gosh. We're getting everyone mushroom. Okay. And one more roll, three, oh, okay. So mushroom pizza, which is like all the it's in the world. Like, oh, holy heck, that would make me just 
be very, very sad. If I got a mushroom pizza in front of me and that's literally the only thing on, yeah, no. So, but before I taint your image, what is your favorite pizza out of all this? Cheese, pepperoni, mushroom, Hawaiian, sausage, supreme. Tell me what your favorite is. And then I'll talk about mine and Miss B's and Mr. A's. We'll go through all of the, you'll get to know all about us in our pizza world. So six plus five is 11 plus four is 15, right? Plus six is 21. So we're gonna save $21 today in Miss B's um, emergency, towards Miss B's emergency fund. Yay! So I'm gonna put this back until I can create the dashboard, but that is on the board now. Did I add that up right, y'all? I can hear someone saying, no, that's not right. Hold on, six plus four plus five plus six. 21, I was right, okay. So that one is done though. Next one is my Panda Challenge, and this is going to our medical emergency fund. Um, well, this is another one that, if y'all don't know, we have multiple emergency funds for multiple purposes. Miss B's emergency fund is to keep her life tick-tocking. What if something were to happen to myself or Mr. A, whoever does take her can take this money and just can you know make her life go for a couple more, a couple more, I don't know, iterations of whatever months, years, whatever it's how much ever I can save. This one is medical emergency fund, and this one is for anything that happens with our family that we need to have a quick money on hand. So whether it be our deduct at the moment, whether it be a deductible or some unforeseen situation, or if we need to fly to one of our loved ones, we would use this as a for emergency for a medical purpose. We would use this money also to get there for that medical emergency. Yeah. So I'm all about tons of med uh, emergency funds to function and to make sure that we can get things and get where we need to be. And to use, each one of these lines is worth $28. We're going to do two lines today because we finished that other one and we're not putting like an obscene amount of money to that one. So we're reversing the rainbow on this one. So, and my pink is drying out y'all. Ah! If you have been here, this is my second set of these retractable markers, which I absolutely love. But my pink is drying out and I am using the last bit of it to make it work. This works for now. And so the next color is red. And let's get that one colored. So 28 plus 28 is what? 56? Yeah, 56. So that is what we're putting into this one today to see if we can get this done by the end of year two. So these two are worth 56. So let's use this 50, 56, 55, 56. There we go. So that is going into our medical emergency fund this time. And this is what we have already. So let's see. So we have 100 in the bank. If you see one of these, this is what's in my high yield savings account and accruing money for me already. So 100, 200 to 50, 70, 75, 76, 8, 9, 81. So 281 so far towards in this challenge towards our medical emergency fund. Um, each one of these are worth 196 and um, together is 588 for this challenge. So this will be a good hunk of chunk of change when we finish. <laughs> Okay, so the next one that I'm doing in my grown folk business section is my personalized panda. You can get this on my Etsy shop. You can get it to say literally whatever you want in the middle. You can get your name, your kids' names, debt payoff. I don't know, scratch my left arm. You can get whatever you want it to say. And you can get it in multiple ranges. So I have this going from 20 to 100, even though that says something different here. I have from 20 all the way up to 100 on my scratch offs. So I could get one of those. I do not remember it. And every single one of them is different because every time I get one ordered, I change it all up. So you'll never see one that's exactly the same. So anyway, so we are busy trying to pay this off. And I'm going to scratch off the next one and hope and pray it's not a big giant one. Oh, it's $50. It's big, but not too big. I'm expecting a hundred dollar one somewhere around here to be honest like a 90 something so that leaves these two ah! so i just need a plan for that in my budget next week so okay so 50 dollars right here coming at us and let's do let's do we're gonna do 60 and do two color these off two of these off and the reason why i'm doing that is i really want to get this paid off and start another one so the, all this money is going to go to a debt payment soon and what did i say we're doing 50, I did 50 and I did 60. So one of those, so two of these, okay. Forgot what I said that quickly. Um, and I wanna make this debt payment with this money, add it onto it, and then I wanna start it again. I'm gonna do a different one. 
So $60 here getting added to our challenge. So we have 100 in the bank for this one and we have 100, so 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 410. So 410 here. And then I have one in my high priority binder that I'm gonna take that cash out and all of this is gonna go to payment. It doesn't help me when it's in these folders. I want it out and in the against the credit card so I stop paying all that interest. Well, you know what I mean. Anywho, so the next and second to last grown folk business is my grow my group play that I have signed up for. And I didn't want to forget, so I put it in my grown folk business section. <laughs> and this has been voting well for me. So this is from Grammy's Journey. She has a group play that we've been doing for the last two months. And so we've been really consistent since it's sitting in this folder. Um, I touch it every week. So this one is going to save us $30 and we only have two scratch offs left. So I think we're just going to go on and finish it probably. So this is a $2. Yeah, we're definitely going to finish it today. Um, and so we get a day, a week off before we get Miss Grammy's next one in here. So, and this is a seven. So $9 total is what we're saving today for Grammy. I love that name, Grammy. Um, uh, Miss B has named my mom Mammy. She named her when she was uttering syllables. That's what she came up with, and we it we it stuck. It stuck. So we love, love, love um, Mammy as the name for her. So anyway, so we are gonna put nine dollars in. So I'm gonna take a ten, put one back, so thirty dollars total, and we are done with this one. Yay! My bow is over here somewhere. I think no, it's not. It's right here. <laughs> So we are done with this challenge. Thank you, Grammy. And I look forward to doing your next group play. There's a couple other that I want to join. I know Lil's World has one and I want to do hers. And then of course, Elaine realized I've been doing hers for the last couple of months as well. That's been in this folder. Um, so there's another, I keep a couple in here and that's how I touch them every time is in grown folks business. So the next and last one in grown folks business is this one. And this is my drink in my water. Y'all, I did horrible today, this week. So I pretty much didn't do it at all, except for yesterday. Was it yesterday, drink water? Or the day before? I think it was the day before. So today is the... Mm, mm, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Today's the 19th, right? Sunday the 19th. And I haven't done it, and the day's almost halfway over, and I haven't done it. So I'm going to go with I'm not going to do it. Um, This one, I think Friday I did it. So only one that's getting a yes is... <laughs> It's sad, but I'm being honest and truthful, exposing my my dirt, deep, dark secrets. Do not drink my water. Um, so this is the only one that's getting the yay sign that I did it. The rest of them are a no-go. So give me a second to color this off and I'll be right back with you. All right, we colored it in, and y'all forgot where I started. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right? Were we here? Oh my gosh, I already forgot. Was it one, two, Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday? It had to be this. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six plus three is nine. So we're only saving nine dollars today, which boohoo, I wanted to save more. But that's all that we're saving for this. This is a freebie from Liz and Less. Um, she puts out a monthly freebie. And so I try to do it every single time. The only time we didn't do was the Olympics one that we didn't do that. We did something else during the Olympics for her. So anyway, so 20, 35, 36, 37, 38 dollars in our challenge for Liz and Less this month. We're not doing so hot, y'all. We're not doing so hot, but that's okay. So now we're on to adulting stinks. We don't want to do it anymore. We don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we are right here, and our little fried egg tells us where we are, and we are doing this fun challenge from um, Carmen at the Humble Budgeter. I say it every week. I'm doing this alongside uh, Melissa from Melissa Renee Co. We kind of got this together, and we're having a hoot and a half doing it. So you can go on Carmen's web, on her Etsy shop, and get this if you want to do it too. It, it will save you a heck of a lot of money, but it's super fun. So it says, even if the odds are against you... Um, and the way you do this is you roll a D12 right here. 
and you let me put on this side because there's a shadow uh see if you get it even or odd i have always gotten an odd so i just anyway i got an odd so next you well i need that next you roll a regular d6 die or d yeah what am i trying to say am i doing this wrong i'm doing it wrong haha <laughs> starting over so you roll a d6 die and you put it in ah you put it in and i still get an odd <laughs> and then you roll a d12 and whatever you roll you have to double it stop it right insane oh yay i'll take it i'm not gonna lie i'll take that so i got a two and so i'm doubling it and it's a four so four dollars let's go again so four dollars here and let's see let's roll our regular die oh i got it even yay and so we just get to scratch so let's finish the top row because that makes it feel complete so we got a two so we're just gonna save two yay so i'm gonna put one of these nope two uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> why my brain did not compute that so that's six i'm gonna put five back and grab a five there we go so we're done and i think i'm gonna go on and scratch off to finish the row and not the whole row but let's just keep scratching that's a two i want to catch up with myself i'm not gonna lie so and this one is a four so another six and the last one that i'll scratch is a five so that's eleven dollars right there that we need to save so eleven dollars let's see ah okay come back here i'm trying to keep a clean desk today because usually i just make a hot mess mess so eleven dollars coming in here right eleven right there so now we have 110, 15, 16, 17 dollars in here. That looks good. And now we're down to the last row on this challenge. And I'm going to try and speed through this one as well. We'll see how we do with what we roll. Yeah, but we only have one line to go. Yay! Love how I just propelled us into progress. <laughs> Propel to progress. Hey, I patent that. Don't take it. Okay, so the next one is back to school. What, what? I know that that sounds like wrong because we're all obviously in the school year, but this one helps fund her back to school binder, which funds the whole year, y'all. So it says back to school, but it's really just her school binder and everything around her daily life during the school year. Yeah. So anyway, so we are rolling a dice on this one too. And the way that we play this is the it's color coded. This is orange, purple, green, yellow. And so you multiply by the color that's there. So you roll a dice. Multiply it by two, which that's a three. So $6 is what we owe here. So that's a good number. Keep flipping that over. So six there. Let's roll one more time. So it's going to multiply by five. Better be low. Better be low. Oh, it's not low, y'all. It wasn't low. It did not take my threat. So that was 20, right? Uh, No. Yes, by five. So, yep, $20. So $26 is what we're saving in this challenge. And I'm okay with it because all this money is going to go to her back to school binder. And this is the money I'm going to use to fund the next like kind of funding of it. What am I doing? What am I doing? Um, I totally I just don't. Yep. Got it. So now in here we have, we have 120, 40, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4. $164 going into her back to school. So we're going to finish this row and then call this one Dunzo because we saved enough and we want to get more games in here. <laughs> so the next one is our fun monster mashup from our girl Becca at Becca Budget 777. Me and her are homie G's and we have the most fun. So this is my game with her here. And it's a, it's a memory game, like um, you have to make matches. And so I'm going to, uh, what do you call this? Shuffle. <laughs> Shuffle these up and see what we can do. So every miss, it's going to be worth a dollar. And every pair, we're going to scratch and see what we save for that pair. Yeah. So we have our cards here and we're going to flip them over. So let's see. This is one and two. That was a miss. So that's $1 over here. Let's see. I already forgot what those are. That quick, y'all. That quick. Oh, oh, we got a match though. Yay! Okay, so we didn't have to worry about what those are. Yay! 
So the next one, next step is to scratch and see. Let's scratchy scratch. That's a one. I'm taking it to the bank. And an eight. Okay, so nine dollars is what we're saving here. Let me clean this off real quick. So nine dollars. Let's put this dollar back and take a ten. Yay! That makes me very excited. So we only have a few more like matches to do. Um, and so I'm super excited that we are almost done and seeing we can take this money to the bank. So now we have in this game 50, 70, 80, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 99 dollars. Yay! I'm super excited about that. So we are done with this game for now. So yay. Moving on is shopping small. We get to start a new game, y'all. Yay! I'm super excited about this one, too. So this is the new game that we're going to put into this spot. And it is uh, recognizing giving shout-outs to different vendors. This is from Kingdom Planning. If you've never heard about her, go onto her YouTube channel. And it's so much fun. She plays some fun games. And so Kingdom Planning, go check her out. I'm going to make a dashboard for this. But in the meantime, my shopping smalls is going to have to do. And the way that you play this is you set a dollar amount for the circle. So we're just going to do a dollar on the circles. And then when you land on one of these icons, they associate themselves with one of the budgeters here. And we are going to play and give them shout outs. Yeah, it's her favorite budgeters that she watches. I didn't make the list. I'm kind of sad about it. But maybe in her next version, I make the list. <laughs> That's how I feel about that. I'm just kidding. So anywho, so I'm having fun. I'm going to have fun doing this one. So for sure. So let's give it a, a whirl about and see how it goes. So we are going to, and it's all like predicated on different dice uh, sizes, like a D4, D5, what have you. And I have a D4 somewhere. I think it's in here. Okay, so D4 and a D12 right there. If we need anything else and a D, we have another extra D6 if we need it. Okay, so let's roll our dice and see what we get. So this is the start, I assume. Yeah, the, the the YouTube TV is the start. Let's see. It's two. So we got this book. So I guess we mark it off. Yes, because there's other books here. Okay, so let's mark this off and see what we have to do for, um, who is it? Simply Living Saves. Yes. So it says roll a D12. So we're doing roll and save. Can do that. Let's see. So let's do a D12 and we put it in here and we got a five. We can do that. So, and so let's see. And so do, 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 we don't have to multiply or anything. So $5 coming at you for that one. Yay, this is so much fun. <laughs> okay, why am I rolling again? No, we're not gonna do that again. <laughs> okay, so let's keep rolling. Now we did that. It's three spots. One, two, three. So we are good to cross that one over. And it's just a dollar. Let's go again. Four. One, two, three, four. It's a rainbow. Let's see. The rainbow is the Thrifty Sewa Shop. So let's go in there. It says cards, red or black. Ooh. Okay, so let's get a deck of cards out. I have a deck of cards here, so let's get a deck of cards. We're not even going to shuffle. We're just going to take this card that's here, and it's black, and we have to save $5. So let's put this $5 back and take a 10. Bam. Let's do, oh, wait. No. So we're just going to put a 5 here. Okay. This is fun. Okay. So, and this is a freebie. Did I mention that? This is free. I'll go to her YouTube channel and go into her, um her uh, freebies link and get this game, y'all. This is utterly free. Isn't that amazing? Okay, so one more time and then we're gonna call it quits. So one, two, three, four, five. Ooh, we got more. I bet this is Tracy with the dog and the taco. Yep, I was right. Tracy, so predictable. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so D6, if you get an odd and an even. So D6 is this one, so we just roll. We got an even, so we pay $2. Easy peasy, okay. So in here, I just have to put the money away. I think we're done for now, y'all. Let's be done. So that was a lot of movement in the one game. Okay, so the $2 added to this, we saved a total of $13 today. Yay! Okay, so I need to make a dashboard, and I will. 
but that was fun to do in the meantime. All right, so this one is one of my other kind of shout out games that I used from CB Mom, CBA Mom Saves. She sent this to me and a couple other people, I believe, just to play and just kind of get her name out there. And y'all, it's working. I love, love, love playing her games. So I don't know where we ended, but we're going to finish this because she sent me a new one. So we're just going to go and call some people out. I'm not going to call myself out. So, and we're going to run out of twos to consolidate, but that's for to start. And we're going to call myself out first. Y'all know who I am. If you're watching, if you're new here, welcome. Go on and hit that subscribe button because we're a hoot and a half. And we love to laugh, play, and have a good time. So, bam, done and done. <laughs> Next one is Lil's World. And, yeah, we're not even going to roll. Lil's World. And she is, y'all, she is so fun. I watched her. She tells her life story and she holds nothing back. Um, and she is, she's so relatable. I love it. And so go check out Lil's World 733 and give her a hoot and a half, give her a holler, hoot and a half, <laughs> holler and subscribe to her channel. Subscribe to all these people. Bookish Mama's Mama Budgets, kind of what she is. She loves to read. She does things around, you know, like book savings and whatnot. Her channel is fun as well. So we're going to add, so we would put another two in here and that would be six. And so we're going to put one back and get the five. There we go. Um, okay. So keep going. Stuff and budgets. Candy. If you do not watch Candy, she is consistent. That is the word I'm going to use for her. Consistent. And you never, 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 never are disappointed in Miss Candy. So go check her out. She's also fun. She does this fun singing thing on her Mondays, on her minis video. Y'all, it is hilarious and a half. Um, Grammy's Journey, we just talked about her earlier with the group play. Um, she's relatable too, and I do watch her channel. She does go live a lot, so you can catch her real-time live talk. It's just, it's fun. Okay, so we're going to add $2 for that. So we're going to put these three and take another five. We're going to put this five back and take another ten. Bam. So that was Grammy. Who else do we have left? One, two, three, four. We have four left. So Budget with Carly. Her Etsy shop is awesome, y'all. She has some good challenges. Go check her out. Her, her YouTube channel is fun. She does a lot of things similar to me. So you should definitely go check out her fun videos. Um, Norelli, Norellis Lee. Norel, Nori. Oh, get a tongue toaster. Nori is awesome. She is on the scene and she is hot to trot. She is, she's just captivating y'all. I, I look for and binge watch Nori's channel. So go check her out. Saving with Tracy. She's my pun lady. She does a lot of puns on her challenges and has tons of freebies. Go check her out. And last but not least is Jamie. RN Budgets. She is fantastic y'all. <laughs> Jamie is awesome. She's relatable. She's down to earth. She has a fun smile and disposition. Yeah, go check her out. You can't go wrong with any of these ladies. Two, four, six, eight. So eight dollars right here and we are done. I feel like I just did a whole, <laughs> like a read a CV for everyone. So we finished this challenge and now we have 20, 30, 45, 46, 47, 48, 48, nope, 38 dollars, y'all can count, 38 dollars, right there, we finished it, thank you CBA Mom Saves, that was so much fun, and I love doing this little group play you have, that was fun. Okay, so that one is done, and we have her new one in here, it's her Christmas one, and she is selling this on her Etsy shop, y'all, so go check her out, CBA Mom Saves. And it's a fun little like four in one game. So we're going to do this to help save with a little extra for Christmas since we have all of that fun things that we're going to do in my vlog that I'm going to start hopefully this week. <laughs> and then the next one is another dashboard I need to make and it's from Budget Budgeting by Dina US. This is what we're doing with her. It's a fun va uh, Valentine's fun Halloween um, challenge that we are doing. And we are um, having fun. I think we ended up here, right? We're here. And we're trying to look for the um, scarecrow or the bat. That's a bat, y'all. Scarecrow. That's a bat. <laughs> okay, so let's keep going and see if we find it. So it's we have to go either here, here, or here. We're going to go here because I think we need to go up to there. Nope, we're wrong. So we switched icons on us. So we're now we're at the pumpkin. So we need to look for the pumpkin. And if this is how we play, great. If not, this is how we're doing it because I don't know exactly all the rules. 
But hey, we're saving and that's all that matters. So $2 is what we're supposed to save. And I do not have $2. Let this is keep tabs. So two, let's see. This, this are my only options. So let's go, let's go this way. Yay! So that would be $4 saved. Okay, let's go one more time. This, this, or this. I'm gonna go with this. Oh, I was wrong. So white space, $5, so that's $9. Let's stop there for this game. So that's $9. So again, this is from Budgeting by Dina US. It's a fun game. She has a bunch of games on her channel, on her Etsy shop, y'all. If you're looking for some fun game time, go check out Dina. She's, she's a hoot and a half. So what I say, nine? So we're just gonna take a 10 for lack of having money available to us. Bam and bam. So this one is done for the time being. Fun Halloween game. So we're gonna keep playing this through the end of the season and then we'll we'll wrap that one up. So keep on moving, don't stop. Oh, keep on moving. Bam. So we are doing this will you, who will you match with game. And y'all, we haven't matched with many. I am surprised. Well, I'm not surprised. These one-liner pickup lines are <laughs> horrible. So the next one that we are doing is I lost my I lost my phone. Oh, nope, let me start over. I lost my phone number. Can I have yours? No, boo, you can't. <laughs> I lost my phone. Can I have yours? No, my phone number. Yeah, no. Anyway, I put it. It's not a win for me. So scratch right for yes and left for no. That is so corny i lost my phone number can i have yours uh no you can't <laughs> so it's one the answer is one i'm like in my head i'm playing the scenario and there is no way i would have been like that's that's cute let me give you my number no 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 you may not sorry sorry you can't remember yours i got mine memorized locked and loaded just not for you <laughs> Okay, so if you said yes and that tickled your fancy, you would have to save three. So $4 total is what we would have to save for this one. I really want to get these challenges done. So I kind of want to do another one. That was $4. Okay, so that one's going to go into completed. We have I have them everywhere, y'all. The other completed are not in there. It's on the other side. So that was four. I have to remember that. $4. Okay, we only have 70, so we don't have any change. So let's see if we can get something that gets us to a whole number. Okay, so uh, you're so sweet. You're giving me a toothache. That one I've heard before, and I thought that was cute. It's cute. So I'm going to give it the benefit of the doubt and scratch a yes. So that's a total of $8, okay? So I would have saved $4 for that. I'm going to scratch and save for you if you are a yay or a yeser. Holy buckets, that's nine. Wow, that's high. Okay, so you would have saved nine if you said no thank you to that one. Nine, so 13 and four is 17. Oh, okay. We're just gonna take the 15 and run with it. We're good there. So now we have 70, 85, $85 in this challenge. And we are good there. Bam, this is from our beautiful budgets. This has been so much fun, y'all, so much fun. So this one is from our girl Cheesecake Budgets and it's Would You Rather. I love this one because it's thought provoking. We only have two cards left in here, y'all. Two. Okay, so this one is Would You Rather Be Able to Fly or Go Invisible? Ooh, let's see. Would I like to be fly or go invisible? Y'all, I would be hating bugs getting, all I can think of is bugs getting in my face. Like when you could drive fast on the highway and the bugs are like pop, 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 pop on your windshield. I would imagine that happens if you can fly because <laughs> I wouldn't fly slow. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go with be invisible. Also, I can eavesdrop on people way better than I do today because I still eavesdrop. So I'm going to say e or be invisible and I have to save $5. This one we're just saved. We're just scratching one. You have to go buy this if you want to see the opposite number. Cheesecake budget. So $5 is what we're saving with this one. Let's see. We can't make change. Let's keep the two fives and take the 10 at least. Ah. Okay, so that's what we have in cheesecake. We only have 50, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3, 83. We have one left. Should we just finish it? 
let's just finish this challenge and be done and we can get another game in here. Yeah, I'm all about that. So let's just finish this guy and be done. All right, so have you, or would you rather have the power to never feel tired or never feel hungry? Ooh, ooh. I love to sleep though. I like feeling tired because that means bed night, bedtime for Bonzo. I'm going to go with never, I would like the effort never to feel hungry. I just want to eat when I want to. And then I probably wouldn't overeat as much as I do. That's just truth right there. So that's $10. I'd probably be skinnier. And that's always something I aim for. Just less, less, less big. <laughs> so $10. So we're going to put this $10 back and take this 20 That actually works out well for me. So 50, 70, 90, 1, 2, 3. $93 is what this game ended up with. We have scratched all of them off. And now we just have the ones that we didn't go with unscratched. So yay! That is exciting. I might actually gift this to someone somehow or put it in my giveaway, maybe. Maybe I'll do that. Because I played it and it was super fun. And I'd rather have someone else play it and see what they would say. I would love to hear what they would say. So I'm going to say... We're done so with this game. Yay! We did one of the freebies that she sent, but she sent a lot and we didn't do any of those other ones. So I'll probably put it with the with the giveaway with this one. Yeah. I'll put stickers back on it for somebody else. All right, guys. So let's snap this one up and call it good. $93. Yay! So another challenge done. So this one is our poor owl shop one and we have cards for this. This is card gameplay section. <laughs> so we have these cards and we're just saving as it says. So I want to leave money for this because we definitely want to do our character mashup and make more progress. So we're just going to do one and it's $8. Dang it. That's a lot of money. <laughs> so and we don't even have change. No. That's 10 and 10. So eight, y'all, eight. We're just going to take the 10 and take one out and we're short one. So whoops, but that's okay. So now in our owl shop, our owl, poor owl shop uh, card savings game, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 85, $85. Yay. But we didn't have any change. So that kind of puts us at a disadvantage for the next one, but that's okay. So we're going to heart that, say it's done, one that we did. And we're done with poor owl shop. Yay. So the next one, y'all, is our jungle mashup from Save with Sydney Bear. And it's been so much fun, but we are oh so close. And I know a couple of y'all gave me pointers on what to do to make this go faster. Still roll for the both. But just save what I would save up there, down here, and get it done. But y'all, I'm just about, I'm a, I want to do the character fun time that we do. So I am going to roll for the name because I want to. So let's see. Two is koala, so that's what we're doing. We finished all of these, so that's why we're just choosing whatever. And five, we finished. Four, we finished. Let me see which ones we haven't finished. Let's go that route. <laughs> so zebra still has some to do and a lot of monkey. Let's do a monkey. And we have 10, 11, 12. $12 to go in here. So we are going to use all 12 here. And let's go on and color some of this monkey off because I see there's a tenor here that we can get knocked out. Actually, if I do one, no, let's just do it this way. So 12 is what we have to save. So that's what we're gonna put it towards. So 10 and a two is 12. So all our money went there. And we need, now we just need five, six. We're gonna do the character, hold on. We're gonna do the name thing because I'm not skipping that part. Let's see, one, so that's seven total. We're missing $7. Let's make sure we're right on the math, but let's do our character name first. Okay, so if a koala and a monkey got together, the name of their person <laughs> would be koala monkey. Com Comon? Comon? C-O-M-O-N? A Comon? Do you like that? Or what about a kowalki? Kowalki. <gasps> what about that? A kowalki or 
instead of monkey, we can do a conkey. <gasps> That's fun. That's actually something named in my country. And we're, so my family's from Barbados and we eat these things called conkeys. It's spelled with a C, not a K, but it's a, it's a food. Why would I want an animal named after food? I don't know. But it, anyway, so <laughs> it's a K makes it a person or an animal, not a, a thing to eat. And Tihu's. Um, it's made from making it banana leaves and it's made from uh, carrots and all this good stuff. All this good stuff. Let me just say that. And so it's a sweet, decadent something. Anywho. So quonky. Quonky. Conky. C-O-N-K-E-Y. Conky. Conky. We're going with that. So if a koala and a monkey got together, they would have a conky. Yep. Went with it. Conky. Okay, so we pay this. Let's see how much we have. We only supposed to have $7 left in this guy. Let's see if we did our math right. Because, you know, there's always there's always that exception. <laughs> so we have $200 in my high yield savings account making a samula. And to that we have 20, 40, 60, 85, 85, 90. So 90, 1, 2, 3, 4. And we said we had $7 left, which is a $1 over. So we are for all intents and purposes correct yay so we have one more day with this challenge and we can call it donezo and she sent me another one and i want to do it so so bad so that's coming in here next so we just have seven dollars that we need to do so we are going to come in here and actually say we're on that one so we can finish this one so even though we're supposed to be on that we're going to come in and do this first yeah all right our game our rules adulting sucks we don't have to do it by the rules y'all we don't have to do it by the rules <laughs> So we are out of money, which means we're out of things to talk about. Yeah. <laughs> and we are done so. So guys, I want to say this has been a fun, fun day. We are at time, so I can't do any happy mail, but that's okay. We will do happy mail during the week and show you some good things that I got from other budgeters, some gifts that I got, some fun things, y'all. So stick around next week for some happy mail in our videos. Yeah. All right. I'm going to say, please, please, please. Please, please be safe, be kind, be blessed, be kind, be the reason someone smiles today. I told you, like I say all the time, y'all, you don't know what people are going through. So stay this week is the week that I'm not going to get irritated by people's ways, me included. I'm going to choose to be happy and make other people happy despite the way they're treating me. Yeah. All right. And then last but not least, I'm going to say real quick, hit the like button if you can. Um, that helps my video go a long way in other people seeing it and being motivated to smile and save. And, and I do have my mystery box. I only have a handful left. Thank you guys. Thank you so, so much for supporting my journey, supporting my small shop. I am so grateful. I started out with so many and I'm down to five. <laughs> It's amazing. It's truly amazing. Um, but I have five if you're interested. I'm doing the most in those boxes as much as I can. I'm creating almost everything. I did one collab. So if you're interested, please go out there. It will be linked down below. But my mystery box, and I did the commercial probably by now. My little image. Um, but yeah, I would love for y'all to get in on the fun and see what my mystery box is about. If you're interested, there's 12 items in it. So I feel like it's really, really priced at a really good price. Um, because everything in there is way more than <laughs> the allotted amount if you break it down by um, dollar amount. All right, I'm going to stop talking. Um, be the reason someone smiles today, y'all. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Yeah. Have a good week. Bye.